Good everybody, it's Mike, hope you're well. And just a little bit of an update on QR. Uh, it's taking a little bit longer than I expected, but it's coming along pretty well. Um, right, so here we are uh, in the default area where it starts. And I'm just going to show you the entrance. Uh, we've done all the grass. Now all this is brand new, so I'll just come out to here. And we'll just go up in the air a bit. And there it is. So, as you can see, all this area here, um, this, this is not very high resolution imagery, and you can't drive on it. Um, but here, we can actually just go down to about there. Um, we can drive along the outer the outer road, and I've added some trees. These are coming along pretty well. Um, so I've done all this area here. You can actually drive around here if you want to, for reasons I don't know why you would, but you can. Um, now we'll just go back, back up to the top here. Where the heck are we? So I've done all this area here. This is all new. Um, the the track has got uh, some mapping underneath, which I have to um, do some fine tuning on. Um, so the lake, uh, the water reservoir there, looks pretty good. Um, we've got, that's the drag strip, I'm actually thinking of building this, maybe in the future. Um, we've got all the, all the interior done here. Um, the, uh, the tower has now got uh, ambient occlusion. I just need to do some um, resolution change on it. It's not, it's only a low res um, image, so I want to change that to a higher res image so the shadow shading looks better. Um, I will be also doing here with um, HDR, uh, not HDR, ambient occlusion. Um, all the garage area will be ambient occlusion garages here, these garages, um, the uh, the filling station, and the toilets, believe it or not, and we'll do those as well. Uh, we have um, power lines, and that's that power line is exactly how the real one looks. Um, so the lines run from, makes you run right down there, I'm not going to do all those, but that's all the power lines. But here we have the entrance. The entrance looks really good. I went out there the other day and um, took photos of the of the signs. So the signs are up to date as of last week. Um, so we got the sign here, uh, the sign over here. There is a COVID notice there. I'm not putting COVID notice up. Um, you can stick that. Uh, all these bushes and trees are fairly accurate. It depends what year you want to look at. Um, this is a few years old, the photos, so I've sort of got them close to that. Uh, all this area here, we've got, it's very overgrown with grass and trees. That actually doesn't look too terrible. Um, the, the trees here, these are sort of, they're like a tea tree type scenario. Um, I've also raised the the ground here, and that's the viewing um, viewing hump. Um, this road is now done. Um, I'm not going to go super silly with detail over here. It doesn't need to be done. Uh, the fence that is going to be replaced all the way around, and it's going to take 
forever but I will get that done before I release it and I'm going to use uh, this fence which is a much much more detailed fence um, I'm also going to remap all these uh, seats because they're not basically not good enough they're the correct sort of shape and everything but they're not they're not good enough um, uh, got some speakers missing uh, speakers they'll be going around the whole track um, we've got the burnout pad um, everything is just pretty well pretty well done as far as that goes so it's just a few a few more trees need to be done um, I went way out here and I planted a whole heap of trees I don't know why I did it because you'll never see the things but they're out there as you can see on the hill um, a lot of this was also a test to see how how things looked um, at a distance and they look all right so going I'm just going to go up in the sky a fair way there's right out to the horizon uh, they, they're just tree walls there's a river which goes down through there that's done I'm not going to worry about fixing that up because it's not it's not worth doing um, all this is actually lighter um, data so the you know there's actually hills and bumps and holes and all that sort of thing um, all these trees around here I'll be putting a few scattered through here just to give an idea of how it looks and out here as well so the distance is good and they'll just be low poly trees won't be anything special there but all this area here um, along the side of the track I will be um, I'll be doing and getting as good as I can there's another road here um, I will put that in uh, because I think it, it this needs to be done but once uh, QR is done I'll get the AI files worked out and get it released so we can um, get a half decent uh, track uh, I, I'm thinking in the future I don't know how hard it would be to do um, all this sort of stuff's fairly easy um, this is the cart track that's fairly easy to do uh, the buildings there's not that many buildings uh, this is the drag strip I go out here really quite often <laughs> probably once a month or maybe twice a month I'm going out there this Friday coming the 16th I'm actually tempted to build this it it's a fair bit of a thing I'd have to get permission um, I don't think these people here are associated directly with these guys here so I'd have to get permission to to do it but I think it'd be kind of cool if we can get the drag strip working and it's I don't know how to do the timing um, it is a loop so you can come down here come all the way back and have a start finish line again um, I don't know but I know other people have done hill climbs and they're fairly successful but all you really need is a start obviously the start of your timing here um, at half track here somewhere is the eighth mile and then down here where this yellow mark is that's the quarter mile so all you need are those things um, I don't think you can get the 60 foot um, but certainly you should be able to do eighth mile and quarter mile and that would yeah we'll see how it works anyway I might this will be next year so don't you know don't um, get all excited but the actual QR will be released um, before the end of this month 
anyway that's my target so as you can see all these trees here I'll be having trees in here trees in there some trees and bushes up here just just to give it that look when you're driving around the track you can see in the distance um, but that's about it so as far as these dirt tracks and things um, again if I'm going to do this part of the race precinct um, I would actually build from the highway and do this whole section which is not that bad because I've already put all the trees in so that's that part that's parts done um, and building the track quarter mile track it's actually fairly flat and then it drops um, significantly down to here um, so we'll just see I want this to go down quicker but it won't so I'm sure you know if I ask nicely <laughs> I might get permission I'm not going to build it without permission because um, I want to be able to go on the property and take a heap of photos and and build it but yeah as you can see the track does does come down down to here so that it'll be all redone um, but we'll see how we go um, I'll figure that one out in the future but at the short stage we will get um, QR back running and um, get it finished so we can go out there and have some fun all, all the layouts will be done and um, we shouldn't have any of the online issues I had with the earlier version anyway thanks for watching and I will update you in a few weeks